Welcome back to another episode of Chainsaw Man. Last episode, grabbed power stitch three times, and what happened at the end? He felt empty. Why? Actually, it's quite philosophical. It's not really about getting to the goal, right? There's two parts to this, but it's about a dog chasing after a car, and he's so happy to chase the car, but once he gets to the car, what does he do? He doesn't know what to do with it, right? At the end of the day, a goal, honestly, is a lot about the journey itself. And on top of that, there's the intimacy aspect. Makima tells us all that etchy loot stuff. One night stands, sure. If you're down bad, if you're so horny and you want to know what it's like, go ahead. But then afterwards, you'll feel empty because you skip the intimacy step. If you get to know somebody, if you get to get super intimate with somebody, and then you do the three squeezes, it will be completely different. You can kind of tell how Makima just has Denji just in the grasp of her. Go like this with her palms, but you know. And then we got the gun devil. Suddenly a change in topic. We were just talking about squeezing tits. And then he's like, oh, by the way, can you kill a gun devil for me? So everything is just slowly laid out by Makima. We can also see in Aki's flashback that the gun devil was the one that wiped out his family. Crazy. 1.5 million dead in the span of two minutes. We didn't even get to see the gun devil. We just saw it just, I don't know, just shoot shit, I guess. And we just saw everything just get blown away. And then we get to see the rest of our squad. Himeno, I forgot the other guy's name. Koveni. Koveni is a special one. Don't forget about it. We get to see everybody else's power just a bit. Himeno has like the ghost power. And now we're in this house. We're getting, right. We're, the whole point now is to collect the remnants of the gun devil so that when it comes together, it'll get closer to the gun devil and then we'll find it. Kind of like collecting Dragon Balls, I guess, but we'll see how this goes. Let's watch today's episode. Kobeni is never, like, she's always just sweating buckets. She's sweating and she just got this nostril coming out. <laughs> Pretty cute, though. Hello. Why is Kobeni going like this? <laughs> just Kobeni noises. What if you try to go out the door? Now, are you going to come through the front of that room or... Hello. Yeah, we're looped. Has Kobani said a single word in this anime so far? Or has she just only made noises? I love her though. She's great. <laughs> then she's in bed. <laughs> Got his priority straight. Uh, we're on the 8th floor, and we're stuck. Yeah, the doors are looped, the stairs are looped, and Denji wants to sleep. <laughs> Is that her first line? No, don't give up, Kobani. Come on. She's such a doomer. <laughs> Hang in there, Kobani! Don't give up! Oh, that was her goal? Who forced to hear parents? <laughs> so, they put her into such a dangerous job to pay for his tuition? <laughs> oh, okay, so this is why everybody keeps making the memes of Kobani's devil contractors with the slopey blow jump. <laughs> I forgot this introduction for her. Just a normal girl again. Just the most average normal girl that got looped into. What's so funny? <laughs> I'm just laughing because power is laughing now. Denji's just... <laughs> yeah, kind of. Denji's the most uh, happy one. The most positive one so far. Oh, come on, don't worry like that's not gonna do anything. At least Denji's got the right attitude. <laughs> Maybe if you take a sleep, it'll work out fine afterwards. Thank you, devil. I love Denji. Aki's bewildered. He's like, is this guy for real? Is he actually sleeping right now? This motherfucker in the middle of a mission when we're all just panicking. <laughs> he fell asleep. Arai is just collapsing mentally. <laughs> what? So, how does that make sense? She started freaking out and started drinking toilet. <laughs> the Nobel Prize in what? Oh, okay. Uh, that's a bold goal. You want to be the Prime Minister. Uh, I mean, she's not <laughs> She's not wrong. This is actually great commentary on the shitty politicians that fucks up the normal working class people. <laughs> yeah, Himeno Aki for sure are like veterans. Like you can see, yeah, she's, you can see that uh, she should be fucking jeweling, man. It'd be better for you. Like, don't smoke. Smoking is bad for you. Don't smoke. And if you smoke, quit. Why are you doing this to yourself? Smoke weed instead. But what I'm trying to say is, Kobeni and Arai are very new to this. They're panicking. They're completely out of it. Aki 
and him and were completely fine. I don't like the fact that they're doing a flashback right now of Himeno and they're trying to make us feel for Himeno and Aki. What if she died in this fucking episode, dude? Don't! This fucking amount of death flags is insane for both. Like, the moment that the author tries to, like, make you cling on to people, have an emotional attachment, it's not good signs for the future, man. Nowhere out. Now they're gonna go on a nicotine withdrawal and start molding. These addicts. Oh. A little... A little mm. It's all business here, don't worry, Denji. He wouldn't sacrifice Denji. Mm, I don't think so. He's the main character, come on. But in a show like Chainsaw Man, honestly, I could believe it if they fucking gave him up. It's such a ridiculous show. Gobeni? Arai? Who's got the knife? Who's got the knife? Arai? Oh, it's Gobeni! Gobeni's the first one to sell him out! Oh god, Kobani's got a knife! Watch out! <laughs> Come on, Kobani! Pretty cool kick. Damn, not even faced. <laughs> no. <laughs> now she's got even more liquids coming out of her face. I can't believe she's trying to suck that shit out of me. I mean, if you're a completely average normal girl that has no powers and you're hopeless, then maybe it makes sense, cool. yeah. Is it gonna come here? Even yeah, though we're like locked? Yeah. Is that Arai? Dude, Arai? This piece of shit. I mean, I'm being much harsher on him than Kobani. Kobani ran at him with a fucking knife. Yes, I agree, but how? Power really wants a Nobel Prize to become the Prime Minister to increase the sales tax by 100%. <laughs> what an evil demon! Oh, we're devil hunters. Whoa, hey! He acknowledged Denji as like a non-devil even though before, you know, he was quite hesitant on accepting him. Wait. Oh, I thought the time moved for a second. Oh, we're just gonna... <laughs> Wait. So, it doesn't advance on us? We just... It's just blocking the hallway? <laughs> Wait. He's just stalling us out? We need to like light it on fire. Sword? Wait, 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 what does the sword do? Himeno is pretty serious about this. Himeno is pretty adamant about not using the katana. What, 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 what? What happens if we use the katana, huh? Oh, come on, you can't say it like that. The food. Did Kobeni eat it all or did Denji eat it all? Somebody ate it all. <laughs> Koveni, was it you or Denji or Power? Yeah, it's... <laughs> She's like, we don't eat it. <laughs> Maybe. Wiped her mouth. I didn't eat it. <laughs> yeah? What did you figure out? What is it, Koveni? You found a secret? You're playing with Power now? She is fucking losing it. She's got a knife though. Oh god, Kobani's got the knife! Oh. Kobani's just having a full on fucking panic attack now. Wait, is that I gonna actually get. Wait, 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 Kobani, relax! It's like reacting to the screen, but. The fuck? Wait, it was chilling before. I don't know who's more dangerous right now. That devil outside or Kobani with a knife? You be the one to kill Chainsaw. Everybody's after the Chainsaw, but why? The eternity devil. Infinite. That's actually kind of scary. That's kind of crazy, the eternity devil. Wait, 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 wait. The entire building's great. What the fuck? Kobani, watch out! Kobani, come on! But honestly, if you, if they were if you were just complete normal people without any powers, Himeno really doesn't want the katana to be used. 
just like locking him. Oh, what yeah, took that sword? But again, if you're Arai and Kobe, I think it's a normal reaction to have. But a lot of years. How much? How much? Some crazy powers going on. You got to trick your lifespan to use a katana. But how else are we gonna get out? Oh, you won't actually stab him, would you? Oh, who got stabbed? Someone got. Aki got stabbed. Honestly, we should have let Kobani stab Denji because he can recover. You know, he rips the cord, he fucking recovers. But Aki's a. He can't do that shit. What is you? What have you done, Kobani? <laughs> but. Our goals align. Aki's being such a bro. Damn. And he does have the guts. Aki has completely accepted Denji. Before he was completely against him. Empowered, but now? We're kind of bonding, right? Yo, we got some bros! I don't know what. I don't know. Kobeni, draw Aki sword and use it. Kobeni! This is on you! I mean. Denji, just fucking rip the chainsaw and do something. But if we do that, won't it just multiply? If you tear it up, I can't take the pain anymore. That's some ridiculous logic. Just keep beating it down until it wants to kill itself. <laughs> yeah, but it's gonna multiply. Uh, Alright, let's give it a try. Alright, go in. The chainsaw's revving! Oh, it's going inside the body. And then it'll just like cut itself out. I mean, it feels like we're just like... We're an infinite Mugen kind of thing. That's another episode of Chainsaw Man. I think the MVP of this episode, even though she did fuck everything up, it's gotta be Koveni. Now you see why people are so hyped about Koveni, right? She's just a normal average girl that just happened to be thrown into this crazy fucking line of work. She has no powers. She's just a normal, regular human, and she has to fight these devils. How? I don't know. I, I, I honestly don't know. All she does is panic. She's constantly sweating or crying, but that's why I think a lot of people love her, because she's not some kind of crazy person with powers. She's just someone average that's trying to get by, right? It's pretty funny. It's kind of funny that I shit on Arai <laughs> more than Koveni, even though Koveni is the one with the sword. I guess double standard. She's a complete wife. What can I say? What can I say? One thing important that we did learn is devils are scared of chainsaws. I don't know why. And Aki's katana. If he uses it, more lifespan gets shaved away. Who knows how much, but these powers, the kind of sacrifices there is, and the way that they kind of built up Himeno and Aki in the flashback scenes, I don't think they're going to live for too long. Nobody, I mean, they've, it's, already multiple, it's, it's been already stated. Nobody in this line of work won't live for too long, but... At least power might become prime minister one day. <laughs> if you stick around this song, if you didn't throw a reaction, you already know what I'm going to say. Check out the other videos and playlists to my channel. If you watch another video immediately after this one, it helps the YouTube algorithm push out my small channel to recommend it so that I have a chance to compete with some of your favorite reactors. Until next time, guys, take care.